Hello, Elizabeth here, and today I'm going to show you how to cover a tumbler in glitter using the Tacket method. This method is especially effective with super fine holographic glitter. It's really easy to do and gives a super sparkly and smooth finish. I did try this method with a chunky glitter and it didn't really work. So if you plan to try this, definitely stick to a very fine glitter. I'm gonna walk you through everything step by step. I'm using a stainless steel tumbler and I just gave it a base coat of acrylic paint that matches the color of glitter I'm using to avoid any patchiness or the original color shining through. The product I'm using to apply the glitter is called Aline's Original Tack It Over and Over. It's meant to be a temporary and repositionable adhesive, so when it completely dries, it remains sticky. I'm thinning it out with a bit of water and using a paintbrush to apply it all over the surface of the tumbler. You can find links to everything I'm using in the description. Once I had the entire tumbler coated, I let it dry for about an hour. The tumbler was sticky to the touch, but not wet, so the glue doesn't come off on my finger. Then I put a piece of parchment paper under the tumbler to catch the glitter and shook my holographic blue glitter all over the surface of the tumbler. Because the glue stays sticky, you can use your finger to kind of buff the glitter right into it, which will really bring out that holographic laser effect. There will be quite a bit of excess glitter buildup, which you can use a dry, bristled brush to just scrape away, and it will leave behind only the glitter that is stuck in the glue. You can see that the glitter that's stuck is super shiny, but I did have a couple of patchy areas because I think I just used too much water the first time and made the tacket too thin. So I applied a second coat of it with just a tiny bit of water so it was still pretty thick, and I coated the whole thing again using a sponge brush so that it would be less streaky than the paintbrush I used the first time. Again, I let that dry for an hour and then applied another layer of the holographic blue glitter. It definitely stuck better this time around. I buffed it in with my fingers and used the bristled brush to remove the excess. The glitter was looking fabulous after round two, super duper sparkly. So then I did a layer of UV resin to seal everything in, smooth out the texture and make a nice shiny top coat to protect the glitter. You could also do this with two-part resin. I just prefer UV resin because you can cure it really fast with a UV light or outside in the sunshine instead of waiting overnight. Once you have it coated in resin, you can add vinyl decals or whatever else you wanna do with this tumbler, or you can just leave it glittery because it is gorgeous as is. The Tacket method is so great for fine holographic glitters because it really brings out that reflective laser effect. Other methods of applying glitter just don't have the same shine and smooth texture that this method does. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel and leave a comment letting me know what you would like to see next. See you later.